بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ناظرین کیریٹ کالج حسن ابدال میں یوم والدین کی تقریب کے مہمان خصوصی گورنر پنجاب محمد بلیغ و رحمان تھے انہوں نے خطاب کیا ہے اور کیریٹ کالج کے سربراہ جو ہیں برگیڈیر ریٹائرڈ ناصر سعید خٹک ستار امتیاز ملٹری انہوں نے بھی اس موقع پر حد و خال جو ہیں کالج کے وہ بیان کیے ہیں آپ کو دکھاتا ہوں یہ رپورٹ تقریب کا آغاز تلاوت قرآن پاک سے ہوا ہے
the authority participating in British councils, the whole world video competition, the result of which should be out in a few weeks. We continue providing the students a vital and in-depth perspective of the complex 21st century world by exposure to get guest speakers to tell on a wide variety of subjects. The focus on intellectual and academic pursuits have not lessened our emphasis on the core of physical fitness. I'll just make a mention of a few things I have to. Cabinet Abdul Ahad Hussain Dilani, first year Jinnah when he became Minister of Fit, he completed, he completed the one mile in five minutes, three seconds, he did 24 pull ups, he did 188 sit ups, and he did 263 push ups. A team comprising of cadets Ali Hassan Malik, Harun Adnan, Dala Hussain, Ibrahim Tariq from Hadelwing broke two college records in swimming. I must mention Cadet Gurbaz Khan, big commander of the Rapid Wing, who broke nine college records in athletics, which included, which included improving his own record in 100 meters from 11.20 seconds to 10.81 seconds, which is a serious college record. Overall, ladies and gentlemen, we awarded about 2,300 certificates to our students on the diverse range of activities which she undertook. In addition to extensive services provided by the hospital, we need to control of, of seasonal payments the well-being and psychological services made a substantial impact on the emotional well-being of the tenants. With a mission to inspire great resilience and leadership skills, we have introduced social and emotional classes to equip our tenants with skills for lifelong learning, well-being and success. Before moving to the Ministry of Academics, I want to make a mention of our focus on teacher training. Apart from the fortnightly and more internal professional development, we focused on national and international training for our teachers. This was undertaken to broaden the vision and alignment as per CCH mission and objectives. Our teachers participated in 37 subject specific training sessions with Cambridge International and earned another 37 online certifications from various resources available. In addition, they participated in a large number of webinars, went abroad for training, and in the near future would be partaking of international conferences. Coming onto our Ministry of Academic Excellence, six of our boys got Outstanding Learners Award uh, in Cambridge. This included subjects. This included talking subjects in Pakistan at a global level and scoring very high. Our HSSC, O level, and other averages remain excellent also. Building on the academic results and the round sphere of activities, our guidance and test placement cell also remain busy by organizing multiple individual and collective sessions. This included inviting national and international universities to the campus. The hallmark of this was that we had 118 acceptances for our students from international universities and we had partnerships amounting to US dollars 3.02 million. The result of this focus on shaping our students for excellence is reflected in the placements of the students of 65th century which passed out last year in August. We have boys joining multiple international universities in different fields, joining lums in different disciplines, joining the Pakistan military Academy, IBA, FAST, Medicine, NUS, and other educated universities. Ladies and gentlemen, the credit of making us realize our vision of shaping excellence rests with all of you. I need to start from the Chairman Board of Governors, the Honorable Governor Punjab, who has a, who's a consummate professional with an eye for EDA. The board has provided us the vision of making Cadet College Hassanabad a globally competitive and international school, which we are actively, actively pursuing for the last four years. The triad of parents, teachers, students, 
is equally to be is to equally credit for the success. The parents who are trusting their sons with us and ensuring our standards and expectations are met. The faculty and the staff for ensuring that every aspect is done with an eye towards excellence. Last but not the least, the current cohort of Italians, your children, dedicated, energetic, and focused young boys who put in their best in the complete spectrum of activities and are truly second to none. Ladies and gentlemen, for your guidance, support, cooperation, trust, and efforts, I thank you. CCH by Allah's benevolence is in all aspects of providing wholesome and well-rounded ed well education to the students. These boys gain entry to this institution through an all-Pakistan open merit neat blind competitive exam. Year after year, it finds, by Almighty's grace, mention in all there is for a high school to be. Nevertheless, it is our considered opinion that we need to continue expanding in search of excellence and endeavor to become truly second to none. We embark on this goal based on fantastic values of academic excellence, character development, personality grooming, physical fitness, universal values of citizenship and leadership. These ideals form the bedrock of our future endeavors. What you witnessed today was a glimpse of the manifestation of these values. The clubs and societies represent our project-based endeavors towards creativity and collaboration. The grim emits our quasi military tradition with a focus on discipline and a structured way of life. The unarmed display is our emphasis on physical fitness. The horse riding symbolizes one of the many skills we encourage by the cultural show represents our diversity. As we continue to develop a plethora of skills, attitudes and competencies, competencies in our students to allow them gain a competitive edge once they meet, reach the next level and move on to serving not only Pakistan but humanity at large. For this process, we need your support and praise. In the end, allow me to thank you once again, Honorable Governor Punjab, sir, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, your presence here today made our special day particularly exceptional. I am grateful. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Brigadier Retired Master Fatiksa, Principal Ted College, Hasnatar. We also have with us Professor Dr. Zafar Ali Chaudhary, Vice Chancellor of Faisalabad Medical University, Member of Board of Governors, and a proud Abdalian himself. We have with us Dr. Uzaira Rafiq Sarwa, Vice Chancellor of Fatma Jinnah Bhimandi University, and Member of Board of Governors, Mr. Amir Ali Shah, Member of Board of Trustees of Kent College, Hassan Adal and Government Fund Trust, distinguished guests, dear proud parents, ladies and gentlemen, and our students, our future, our pride, our heroes. Assalamu alaikum. It is indeed a matter of great pride and honor for me to be amongst you on this auspicious occasion of the annual KFC. What a nice sunny day. Whenever I visit, whether as a chief guest on national outreach program, when I was Prime Minister of Education, or for the meetings of Board of Governors, and now on annual KFC, it is always a pleasure to come to this prestigious institution of our country. Consistently maintaining its strong contributions to the country and to the world, and is consistently getting better. Being constitutional head of the province as governor and president of the board of governors of Kerry College, Hassanatal, it gives me great satisfaction and pride. Alhamdulillah. Well done, principal staff. Well done, faculty, and well done all the staff, teachers, and I must always appreciate the worthy Board of Governors which give their time and energy and provide guidance to the school and they do it on a pro bono basis. So thank you very much. Keep it up. By the way, I must tell you 
How immensely I'm pleased and impressed by what I have witnessed here. The proof of the fact that education is a holistic approach, which requires undertaking a range of activities, gaining rich hands-on experience, and it is not confined to classroom learning alone. It is the overall experience. The exhibition, organized and put together by various science and arts club of Cadet College, is reflective of the wide range of skills that are cultivated in the development of the Cadet societies. I was happy to see the use of technology in robotics, in electronics club, and so many other things which were giving the students a flavor of what they had to learn and keep learning ahead and keep using ahead. And the dimensions which the history society, the anthropology and, and of religions and, and the uh, religious, uh, comparative religion society, and so many other diverse societies are providing excellent exposure to our futures, our future assets. The parade with synchronized movements of the smartly dressed contingents and well turned on credits was further evidence of the high standards of health day. The colorful unarmed combat display for the young credits, their coordinated movements, the equestrian show, the PT show, especially horseback archery riding on the galloping horses, perfectly balancing themselves and making arrows meet their targets so well was amazing. And I heard this is a new tradition which has been started. Well in principle, keep it up. The cultural performances, the band performance, and rest of the activities were all have warmed up our hearts. I must say that it is a true reflection of Itaha or Tanzim. Highly disciplined teamwork, I must say. Ladies and gentlemen, one vital reason for taking pride in this great institution of our country is that it has steadfastly committed itself in the right grooming of our young, inculcating good values and good creative traits and discipline in them. Dear students, this is the recipe for success. Always remember that it will be your character which will make you successful in this world and hereafter. Being a Dalian requires you to always display character, courage and honor, CCH, and stay second to none, which means always excel in everything you do in life. It is the excellence which will always keep you successful in China. Personally, for me, the significance of my visit to Kerry College Hassan Abdal is that it reassures me that the college is among some of those places which strictly uphold the policies of merit, fair play, glorious traditions and high standards. The reassurance strengthens my belief that the future of our country is bright, inshallah. We can set not only any kind of challenging goals for ourselves, but have the capacity for their appropriate realization also. The bright faces of these young men, who are fortunate enough to be standing here, hold the promise of a bright future for our country and the coming generations, and inshallah, Pakistan will one day take its rightful place in the Committee of Nations. The home and the school together deeply influence and shape the growth and development of the destiny of a child, which ultimately is the destiny of a nation, because individuals make a mighty nation. Iqbal ne Yaqub kaha tha, Tal Khanayim Rabte Milat se hai, Tanha kuch nahi, Moj hai darya mein, Aur Darun hai darya kuch nahi. So, learn to collaborate and work in teens. It is therefore imperative for parents and teachers to force ties based on mutual understanding and cooperation to achieve the best possible results with respect to education and all long personality development of the students. Alamek Balset, Sabak Pirpar, 
सदाकत का अदालत का शिजात का लिया जाएगा तुझसे काम दुनिया की इमामत का ये स्टूडेंट्स ऑल ऑफ यू हैव टू लीव The poetry which I just presented to you of Allah Iqbal gives you the recipe to become the leader. Iqbal says you have to be truthful. Sabatpar sadaqatka. You have to be just adalatka. You have to be courageous. Leaders are courageous. They have courage in you. And you will be global leader. Because we need to be on the ground here today. So inshallah, we, in you we see our future leaders. with the advent of technology and artificial intelligence tools the dynamics in education are also changing fast mr principal i have noted with a sense of satisfaction that the college is introducing new learning tools and devices in the classrooms and the hostels that will help the students in keeping pace with the rest of the world i just saw a presentation of such apps and beautiful electronic tools which would shortly be used and the college has already started work on them and starts its research. That surely is the right way of preparing your students for the future challenges in the highly competitive international job markets because the world has become a global village now. And the days to remain confined within the bounds of one's own country are over. We have to serve wherever we go and we have to be relevant we have to have right attitudes and in turn it is our country and our family and our people who will benefit from you no matter where you serve but our quality should be our country our homeland because charity starts from home ladies and gentlemen the hallmark of a really good institution is that its alumni should contribute significantly towards the growth and advancement of the society in this respect the dalians have surely distinguished themselves by excelling in almost all orders of national and international alumnus which makes us proud and more confident i invite all alumni and all dalians to become part of this institute by contributing with their suggestions and with their experience alhamdulillah the word of dalian has become a brand symbolizing character high standards and excellence and we know that pursuit of excellence must always continue we must always keep on striving to become better and we must not settle where we are inshallah we and inshallah this state college as well we keep on getting better with every passing day as it is now The overall academic results and achievements in wider range of extracurricular activities we are testimony to the fact that the institution has distinguished itself setting higher and greater challenges for its contemporary counterparts in this respect the, the, the distinctions earned by individual cadets are highly commendable and deserve our due recognition and appreciation all the cadets we just got decorated to see accolades and honors they all uh, deserve our appreciation and thanks on their back keep it keep it up and keep showing the light to others here i sincerely feel that teachers and staff of this team and institution deserve our special appreciation because without their dedicated efforts and hard work the college would not have been risen to present day life of success these cadets We can never thank our parents enough. Always show gratitude to anyone who brings good to you. And in that respect, first and foremost are our parents. As the ayahs of Quranic Reem, which were just recited in the beginning of the program, were telling, these were the divine guidance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, 
and they were telling about the, how we should be thankful to our parents. And after parents, it is the teachers who show us the light. And we can never thank our parents, our teachers, and the society, and the country, and all the people around us who bring good to us and help us make ourselves better and get ahead in life, inshallah. In the end, I congratulate all these parents and their parents who have won prizes in multiple fields, and also all those who have moved forward and learned and participated in different events and, and, and have done well in exams and in academics. I would also like to thank the college for inviting me to preside over this grand function, which gives me more confidence by looking at all the achievements and, and, and successes of the college. My best wishes to the college in its future pursuits. Inshallah, myself and the Board of Governors and all of us in society and the governments will keep on doing their jobs, contributing, making this government institute even better. May Allah bless us all. Thank you very much. And Allah Hafiz, Pakistan, Pakistan.